Hello everyone. In this video tutorial, we'll learn how to create flat style cocktail glass in Illustrator. The process is very simple and you will learn some Illustrator tips along the way. We will be using this color palette for our design. Let's start by creating the glass shape. Now copy and paste it in front using Ctrl plus C and Ctrl plus F in Windows and Command in Mac. Scale the size down using Alt and Shift key. Now, using the Direct Selection tool, select both the upper corner points. And, using the Shift key and click on the down button and that will nudge the points to a good distance. Give it a fill color from our color palette. Let's draw a long rectangle for our straw. And, Give it a black fill color. Rotate it and place it inside the glass shape. The lower part of the straw doesn't seem like it is submerged under the liquid. So, let's give that part a different color. Draw two squares, one with the fill color of the drink and the other with the color of the straw. Select both the squares and go to Object, Blend and Blend Options. Select specified steps, and the steps count as one. Again, go to blend and click on make. Now, we will get one more square with a fill color which is in between the other two colors. Now, in order to split the straw into parts, select the drink, and the straw. Go to the pathfinder tool, and click on the divide. Right click and select ungroup. Now, we have all the parts divided. Give the lower part of the straw the fill color. Let's draw ice cubes. Draw a square and give it some rounded edges. Add couple more ice cubes. Now, to make the ice cubes look like they are inside the drink, we will follow the same process as we did for the straw. Give it a color that is in between the color of the drink and the ice cube. For the top ice cube, we need to split it into parts. We will use the divide tool of the pathfinder again and split it and give it the in-between color. The other two ice cubes are behind the drink. So, to bring them front, select the drink and right click. Go to arrange and click on send backward a couple of times. Let's draw the next cocktail glass. Select the polygon tool. Alt click and changes the number of sides to 3. Duplicate the triangle, and reflect it. Adjust both the triangle shapes. Let's draw a long rectangle, and place it between the two triangles. And align them all. Unite the rectangle and the bottom triangle using the Unite tool of the Pathfinder. Use the direct selection and select the corner options and round them a little bit. Duplicate and scale the top triangle and give it a pink fill color. Use the curvature tool and add a point on the top side of the triangle and curve the edge. Let's create a toothpick and olives. Scale it down and place it inside the martini. Now to make the toothpick look like it is half submerged in the drink, we should follow the same process as we did before. Use the blend tool to get the in-between color. And split the toothpick using the divide tool and give the submerged part of the toothpick the in-between color. Let's create the third cocktail glass. Let's create a circle using the ellipse tool. 
Now, draw a rectangle and place it at the top of the circle. Select both the circle and the rectangle, and click on the minus front tool of the Pathfinder. Duplicate and scale the shape down for our drink, and give it a green fill color. Copy the bottom part from our second cocktail glass. Let's draw ice cubes and a straw. And give the fill color as the in-between color for the ice cubes and submerged part of the straw, just like we did it for the first two glasses. Our three cocktail glasses are ready. You can give a try with some other glass shapes using the same procedure. If you find this video helpful, click on the like button and hit subscribe for more tutorials on Illustrator and After Effects. Thank you.